Note. This article is based on the Catholic Encyclopedia, 1913 and contains a large amount of outdated information throughout, including the numbers of students. Specifically, many of the practices and forms of dress described changed dramatically during the 1960s. See also Pontifical University. The Roman Colleges, also referred to as the Pontifical Colleges in Rome, are institutions established and maintained in Rome for the education of future ecclesiastics of the Roman Catholic Church. Traditionally many were for students of a particular nationality. The colleges are halls of residence in which the students follow the usual seminary exercises of piety, study in private, and review the subjects treated in class. In some colleges there are special courses of instruction but the regular courses in philosophy and theology are given in a few large central institutions such as Pontifical Urbaniana University, the Pontifical Gregorian University, the Pontifical Lateran University, and the Pontifical University of St. Thomas Aquinas, Angelicum, Purpose, the Roman Colleges, in addition to the obvious advantages for study which Rome offers, also serve in a certain measure to keep up in the various countries of the world that spirit of loyal attachment to the Holy See which is the basis of unity. With this end in view the popes have encouraged the founding of colleges in which young men of the same nationality might reside and at the same time, profit by the opportunities which the city affords. Structure. The Roman colleges are grouped in several clusters, each of which included a center for purposes of instruction in a number of affiliated institutions. Each college has at its head a rector designated by the episcopate of the country to which the college belongs and appointed by the Pope. He is assisted by a vice-rector and a spiritual director. Discipline is maintained by means of the camerata system in which the students are divided into groups each in charge of a prefect who is responsible for the observance of rule. Each camerata occupies its own section of the college building, has its own quarters for recreation, and goes its own way about the city on the daily walk prescribed by the regulations. Meals and chapel exercises are in common for all students of the college. While indoors, the student wears the cassock with a broad cincture, outside the college. The low-crowned three-cornered clerical hat and a cloak or soprano are added. Program of Studies Most colleges follow similar academic programs during the year, but variations will be found, and these are due chiefly to natural characteristics or to the special purpose for which the college was established. The scholastic year begins in the first week of November and ends about the middle of July. In most of the courses the lecture system is followed and at stated times formal disputations are held in accordance with scholastic methods. The course of studies, whether leading to a degree or not, is prescribed and it extends, generally speaking, through six years, two of which are devoted to philosophy and four to theology. To philosophy in the stricter sense are added courses in mathematics, languages, and natural sciences. Theology includes, besides dogmatic and moral theology, courses in liturgy, archaeology, church history, canon law and scripture. An oral examination is held in the middle of the year and a written examination at the close. The usual degrees are conferred in philosophy, theology, and canon law. Since 1909 degrees in sacred scripture are conferred upon students who fulfill the requirements of the Biblical Institute. Each college spends the summer vacation at its villa Torah or country house located outside the city and generally in or near one of the numerous towns on the slopes of the neighboring hills. Student life in the villa is quite similar to the routine of the academic year in regard to discipline and religious exercises, but a larger allowance is made for recreation and for occasional trips through the surrounding country. And while each student has more time for reading along lines of his own choice, he is required to give some portion of each day to the subjects explained in the classroom during the year. Intercollege activities not only do seminarians from the different colleges follow their studies in the same universities, 
They also take part in extracurricular seminars and conferences as well as leisure activities such as the Clericus Cup, a football tournament created some years ago and won for the past two years by the Pontifical North American College.